Okay, so here we have a normal tube of Pringles. Open it up and you can see half of the crisps have been eaten. Now, who buys Pringles? Let's just think about this for a second. <clears throat> People that buy Pringles like crisps that are perfectly shaped, are not broken, are nicely stacked, are um, consistent every time they open the can. It's all about ease. It's all about simplicity. It's all about comfort. That's why people buy Pringles. So when I get to a situation when I've got half the Pringles in the can and I can't get my hand out to get the rest of the chips in there, what am I left with to do? Well, the only thing I can think of is to pour them out. Now, if it so happened that every time I poured them out, one or two came out, that wouldn't be a problem. But 99% of the time, when you turn them upside down, they all fall over the table. So that works. That's okay, I guess, if you're um, just a pig. But I'm guessing people that buy Pringles aren't pigs. Could also be okay, I guess, if you're uh, having a party and you want to lay all the crisps down on one, uh, on one plate. But what's the main use case? Is that really it? Or is it someone sitting at home who just wants to take one chip out of the tube? So my message basically is fix that problem, innovate, redesign the can in a way that is cost effective and potentially allows you to put the price up and uh, you've got a winner. Thanks.